Next at 6, the Bond County community is facing an uncertain future with regards to its emergency services. All the volunteer EMTs at the Pocahontas Old Ripley Fire District will be let go September 30th. However, as five on your sides, Holden Krewicki discovered, that doesn't necessarily mean the end of life-saving services. For the past 38 years, when people in Pocahontas called 911, I expect the Pocahontas or Ripley ambulance to show up. Jeremy Brown says that's no longer the case since the EMS director resigned in early August. No one was formally informed that the ambulance service had shut down, uh, and we currently don't even know what we have if we do dial 911. We've run out of volunteers, and we don't have enough money to, to hire full time. Uh, paramedics or EMTs. Don Hawley, president of the Pocahontas Old Ripley Fire District, told Five on Your Side there are two options to continue providing emergency services, but both require letting volunteer personnel go in favor of private ambulance services. We're about 245,000 short of having enough money to do it ourselves. So One option would provide advanced life support services to Pocahontas, but the station would only be staffed 12 hours a day. And they would leave at 7 p.m. in the evening and uh, return to Greenville, which is approximately 10 to 15 minutes uh, drive time uh, from just the edge of our district. So it could be several minutes before an ambulance arrives. They can get from Greenville to Pocahontas in about the same time. Our guys can get out of bed, get dressed, go to the firehouse, get in the ambulance and respond. The other option would post paramedics at the station around the clock, but they would only be able to perform basic life support services similar to what's offered now. Uh, I don't feel that a 12 hour service that pulls out of town uh, in the evening time, uh, why is a life uh, less valuable at 7 p.m. in the evening than it is at five in the, in the morning? The future of emergency services in Pocahontas will be decided tomorrow night at a meeting at the Pocahontas Old Ripley Fire Department at seven o'clock. They are asking anyone who plans to attend to get there early because they are expecting a packed house. Reporting in Pocahontas, Holden Kerwicki, Five on Your Side.